Hello everyone, it is Beggles here, and I have to say, I wasn't 100% sure about making a video for an upcoming rhythm game, based purely on not knowing how the genre translates to preview videos. I mean, there is music and beats and all sorts of visuals mashing together, that might create a bit of a headache, but I will certainly do my best. When I first looked into Rhythm Doctor, my thoughts quickly roamed from what the hell is this too? Wow, this is kind of genius. And there's just too much to love when it comes to the creativity, design choices, and just outright uniqueness of this project. If you have not done so already, the first thing I'd be doing after finishing this video, besides clicking on the subscription button, is heading to the official website and checking out the demo. Unfortunately, the Flash browser version is now kind of in dead mode, but when there's a will, there is a way, and you can still download it to give it a play. So what is the deal with Rhythm Doctor? It's kind of simple. You just have to press one button. That's it. Easiest game ever, right? Wrong. This could be perhaps the trickiest game you will ever play that only requires you to use the spacebar. You do have to listen to the music, keep the timings of the beats, and press spacebar on the seventh beat. But as the name of the game might suggest, you are actually a doctor and with your musical prowess, you're trying to cure a bunch of patients from their unique and music distorting ailments. What does this mean for the player? Well, time quickly turns from a relaxing counting exercise to all hell breaks loose and you have to try and keep beats despite some pretty crazy and distracting events coming across your screen. Think beat skips, think pace changes, think your whole screen going wacko, or even just not being able to see your notes at all. Through all this pressure and distraction, what do you need to do? That's right, just press space on the seventh beat. It really is quite genius how simple and yet addictive this little mechanic is. And of course the developers of the game keep throwing new mechanics at you to make sure that you don't start getting the handle of it. There is even boss levels, which is really cool. As I said, there is a demo available to play right now before the game launches on Steam on February the 26th. And just playing through early, already you're being asked to keep track of two different alternate beat sets at the same time. It confused the hell out of me at first, and I loved it. And if you fail, prepare for a nice little F grade pep talk from your patient. So beyond the rhythm mechanics, what does Rhythm Doctor offer you? Really fantastic music and sound effects for a start and cute simple pixel art that is endearing enough without being breathtaking. Reading through the press kit for the release, expect lots of available content, with community created levels already quite popular, and clearly an active bunch of players with this game. There is a storyline there, and a really nice feeling to this game. The aesthetic reminds me strangely in a way of Celeste, not in terms of the art or the gameplay, but in terms of that feeling that this game is going to come up and make me care about the characters and what happens to them. There are some really creative and cool looking levels to play through with this one. And really for rhythm and music lovers who want a challenge, I'd say this one has to be on the must play list. Let me know how you find Rhythm Doctor if you do test out that demo.